Look at him. Not my boy. I was joking. I love Devin. No, the no, first no, thing no. I haven't seen Devin in months, so the first thing I did when I came in was I just gave him a big old hug. So you know. And then you slapped him. No, never. <laughs> Okay, so we got Pokemon Trainer, which is the character I know very well. Then we have and Sora, Sora, this uh, oh, deviant art character from Disney's studios, who is trying to save the light from the dark. I've never played King of Hearts. I have no idea what he even does, except that there's funny characters and Sephiroth is in the game at some point. All I know is that light, know. light, lightness is lightness and darkness is darkness. That's that. That's what I've learned from that game. Uh, and no one dies. No one dies. No one dies. Not for me. I. <laughs> okay, so let's talk about Sora a little bit for realsies. So he dies. He's got. <laughs> he's got this uh, cool thing. Like there, you see that thunder guy. Got the ability to go between three different spells, going for thunder. That's the only worthwhile one. The rest the other two can go screw off. Uh, Blizzica does have the ability to freeze you if you get the point blank, which is kind of fancy and just puts your opponent into a bad uh, position. But fire is like one of those things you just kind of put out there if you have openings. I feel like Fire Aga is a very quick play player kind yeah. of move. Yeah. Because if you just hold, you, you, you have to hold it. Fire. You, you can just, just hold it. Just keeps going. And Sora's got infinite MP in this game, so he can just spam that. Not like Hero, Hero who has got 100. Leaving. 100. 100's good. Kafriz is only 36 it's not MP. As good it's as, It's not as good as infinite MP, bro. I'm sorry. Ooh, there we go. We got that. And another thing about Sora is, is he's got that fancy uh, three-hit combo both in the air and yes. on the ground. And allows him to be able to cancel it into other fancy moves. So you'll be seeing that a lot coming out from Zane. Devin's still hanging in there with that 149%. There's that recovery we were just talking about. Mm -hmm. Bayonetta and Sora. He can just chill down there for as long as That's possible. That's exactly what it is. But, and oh. No matter how good your recovery, though, is that forward tilt. Gonna send you flying. Look at that dash dance. That wow. dash dancing in that this game really is fast. dash dancing in this game is actually difficult. So I gotta applaud Zane for being able to do that. I don't want to break my thumb, so I don't. But oh no, <laughs> I can't do it. My 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 poor thumb can't do. It. I feel like use my palm. And like the thing is, when you do that, it's like you, you can't actually do that in the actual match. You can do it in between stocks, like he just yeah, did. But like yeah, yeah. that would never work. I think you're focused too hard on the dash dancing. They're not focusing on what's happening right in front of you. It's all just fanciness, you know. Oh. Almost got the grab. There we go. Oh. Razor Leaf was hoping for an air dodge. Devin's not gonna be able to get it. I don't think Devin's gonna be able to do a lot of um, a lot of his usual like off the off stage mm. uh, at finishers just because Sora is so goofy in the air and yep. able He's to freeze his opponent just easy peasy. There we go. Oh, but down I throw to Vine Wave. Yo, would this be an upset? I think this would be an upset if Devin wins this, right? No, like that has to be right, right? Didn't say you get top eight last week? Or am I am I I'm, am I bugging? I'm bugging. Uh, I, the, all the leagues are coming like they're they're the same to me. I literally don't remember at all. I'm bugging. I left early because I oh wow. so I have no idea. My only resource. I'm gone. sorry. In the Nummies abyss. was here. And he's saying pretty quiet over there. He's saying pretty quiet numbies. <laughs> But now both characters, or both characters, haha, <laughs> both players back at one stock, a pretty even amount. And I lied because Sora, Zane, they're just absolutely destroying Devin's percentage right now. Oh! Racking up a clean 80%, but Devin letting letting Sora know that just because he's a new character, that old characters can do just fine. It can't change an old dog new tricks. <laughs> I look at Duck Hunt. <laughs> he's a dog. <laughs> I, I, I. I gathered. <laughs> Thanks for explaining. I know. Right? I, needed, I needed the explanation. I know. Sometimes it's just I'm glad. Mine, you I'm know? glad you thought so low of my IQ that I couldn't get it. That made me feel really good. Thank you. So the very dangerous. And I know Blizzaga. <laughs> okay. So yeah, but I got excited because. No, go ahead. Go ahead. I know Blizzaga like actually like arbitrarily sucks. It's the it's the worst of the three spells. But the higher the percentage you are, the longer you will stay. Oh. And that'll be it, that up air. I mean, yeah, up his, his uh, up B. But back to your what you were saying. So the longer that, the more percentage you have, and if you get hit by Blizzaga, you will stay in Blizzaga for a long time. So that gives Sora a lot of uh, leeway to keep you in the air, because he's so floaty, he literally floats in the air. And just wait on you to thaw out, and do exactly what Zane did, where she literally just said, watch this, and use Sora's up B to finish out that game. And give herself a one, a, a, like that that round. Yeah. I couldn't have said it better myself. Oh, no. Yes, you could have. <laughs> I love that zoom in, by the way. Which is Oh. The, the, the last one. Because, like, this one right here. Watch, watch the zoom in. So you'll see that Zane goes for the up beam. And then mm -hmm. uh, grabs the ledge in the middle of the zoom in. 
My yeah, favorite thing ever. Killed him with a ledge grab. Yeah, literally. Also, do you want me to say something or? Oh no, we were just asking if Zane had gone top eight last weekly night. I left early, so we we didn't know. Maybe and I wasn't here. Oh, you I have no idea. Here. Oh. Thanks, John. Always a good, valuable resource I over there. I love all three Bye. of us knowing nothing. <laughs> Bye, nummies. It's not like he has a computer over there where he can look up the bracket or anything. Okay, but the game is playing. The game is playing numbers. What are you doing? <laughs> there it is. I love giving numbers. Uh, well, how do you say poop? There you the go. Okay. Word. Yeah. Just <laughs> smooch. Okay, here we go. We got Sora right here at 61%. Rocking the Kingdom Hearts 1 costume this time around. This is actually my favorite costume because he looks so ridiculous. My favorite one is like the red. And well, I know they're all red yeah. and black, basically. But like. Not this one. No, like, like the red and black. Like, oh, yeah. You know what I'm talking about. Like the red and black one. Like the red the and black The Dream Drop Distance one. one? Don't know what that means. You just spoke absolute gibberish to me. <laughs> uh, the uh, Valor form one. The uh, damn, the, this game looks the, amazing. The, the Kingdom Hearts three one. What <gasps> happened, Devin? I think he lost his jump. I was wondering if he tried to swap inputs and then just kind of slipped his thigh. Mm -hmm. That's unfortunate. That's gonna kill a lot of his momentum too. Devin, I'm sorry. Yeah, because honestly, when you when you lose, lose a stock that quickly, it kind of throws, throws off your whole game. And Zane was just winning on a ledge. Uh, I, I I think he lost his jump. I wasn't really too keen, like paying attention. Mm -hmm. But he seemed way too low. I don't, I don't think he did a change. I think he literally just lost his jump. Unfortunate. But Devin's trying to bring it right back. Oh, he Super. was over. Oh. But sorry, yeah. we're gonna make it back. As long, as long as he doesn't die off the blast zone, he is probably going to stay alive. Devin struggling to get this kill here. Just waits for that downer to come down. Very predictable. Here comes the Sonic Blade. Oh! We on the ledge. Now, I'm thinking... Sora's a, like a light character, a very light character. Yeah, right. That, that Lighter like than good. Isabel. Mm -hmm. Very light character. And he didn't die to any of those attacks. I mean, down throw is a pretty weak throw anyway. Oh, okay. Very bold fair blades into a change back into Ivysaur. It's just a, a little bit of damage as a treat. Man, you saw Zane just kind of going for those counters. Mm -hmm. Like, expecting a flare blitz to come. Oh, bad spot. The sword's going to be able to get back on mm -hmm. there. Using the up B into the Sonic Blade. Gets back on there. 150%. Devin's going to double jump over that Blazaga, which, uh, pretty good uh, tool off stage. That throw is going to kill him. Yep, yeah. yep, yep. That higher percent. See you later. Sora's back throw is. I, I, I want to say it's the strongest of his throws, of all three of his throws before. Oh, but Sora's going to recover just fine. And not, and not even Flamethrower is going to keep Sora at bay. Ooh, ooh, oh, ooh, oh, here ooh. comes the Nair, the Nair loops. Yo, he's got those combo pluses equipped. Look out. It's the way Blizzaga in against a Flare Blitz. Okay, he's going to hold on to that uh, flame on him. Yeah, there we go, 96%. Yeah, he's just keep me at bay with Flare. I mean, with it's literally the door. safe. It's the safest option for Nevin to go for. So I don't blame him for going for it. But it, he's gonna have to eventually have to go do something where he's gonna get this kill, or else he's gonna explode. Gonna up be right through that. That was pretty. If he didn't go for that option, he was pretty much dead. Zane just chilling under the stage. Oh, oh. And counter earning the stage will be the death of De Devin's last stock. Ledge drop. I'm very, you know, Thundaga, the fact that it, I, I peed this earlier, it's able to go through the stage and how far Sora is from below the stage is insane. Yeah. But that clean, clean counter. Ooh, we'll just. It's going on. I mean, it was pretty much like a checkmate. Yeah. There's nothing much that Devin could have done about that. And, you know. I felt like the first game was going pretty well. It was pretty even. The second Devin lost that game, I feel like momentum got the best of him, especially in the second game when he SD'd really early on with when he was with that Squirtle. With that, what happened here? And uh, that pretty much just set up Zane very nicely to make it to uh, finals of his pool, which we'll probably be seeing later on in the night as we get back into the top 16, I want to say, in the bracket. Semis. Semis, whatever it's going to happen. But, guys, it's been a pleasure.